Hey guys, this is just a very quick tutorial. If you've got an old iPad or any kind of older iOS device and you want to be able to use it for things like video and just basic things like that because you know they're not much use for anything else, there's a trick you can do to get apps to, wor to work on you. So you can see on here I've got Netflix, Prime and Instagram and whatnot just to show off, right? But typically what happens when you try to download any new apps, you search and so for instance here's the YouTube one, so it's a very basic one that everything should have on it these days. It's just got a little arrow. Excuse me. If you try downloading it, it says unable to purchase. There's a trick around that. If you've got another iOS device, like I've got my phone here, and if you have them both signed onto the same Apple ID, right? and you have purchased an, the apps on here so if you go on here and you download the YouTube app it'll show up in your purchases so this is signed into the same Apple ID as this is if I go into purchases and search YouTube you can see you use YouTube and now we've got the iCloud icon and the difference is when you download it this, via this method if you click that, it actually asks you, do you want to download the last compatible version? Which, yes. And, yeah, it's just a little trick I found. I thought I'd make a video on it, because the video I found on it, he rambled on for 12 minutes to explain the whole thing. But, yeah, if you find that helpful, I hope you do. I definitely will, because this iPad has been sat in a drawer for years, and now I can finally use it for something. Hope you enjoyed. See ya.